Retailers are worried that the financial crisis may keep consumers from opening their wallets this Christmas season. CBS News correspondent Michelle Geelan is here with that story. Good morning. Good morning. Well, a recent study found that more than a third of consumers say they're planning to spend less this Christmas. That means retailers will be doing everything they can to make sure their cash registers ring during the crucial holiday season. It's not even November and already Christmas sales have begun. That makes shoppers like Kim Feeder see red. You're not in the mood. I mean, it's 70 something degrees out. It's very hot. You don't really feel like you're going Christmas shopping. But with the economy on the brink of a recession, retailers have jump started holiday sales, worrying that this Christmas season may not be so merry. I understand why they do it, because they're hoping people like me are going to shop more. Walmart, the nation's largest retailer, is selling 10 of its most popular toys for $10 each. Early bargains will be a trend others will follow, says retail analyst Dana Tesley. But now with Wall Street coming to Main Street, we're going to see the retailers have excessive promotions through the holiday season. But you'll have to do some digging to find the bargains. One place to look is the Internet, where online coupons can get you deep discounts. Websites like couponco.com list promotions from many retailers. Be aware of online, watch the newspapers, watch their mail. There will be more drops this year with coupons or discounts that are being offered because retailers need to move the merchandise. Experts say this could be a good Christmas for discount stores like Target, Walmart, and Costco as consumers try to stretch their holiday dollars. But many retailers are already scaling back on inventory, anticipating that shoppers will be spending less. I definitely talked to my friends about setting budgets in terms of what we're getting for each other. No matter how tight the budget is, parents will still be buying toys. And history shows that over time, uh, guests always take care of the little ones. Oh, Yo. First try. But will hard times ahead mean Americans opt for less expensive uh, fun? One of the season's hottest toys is called Bakugan. It's an updated version of marbles, a favorite of kids from the Depression era. A starter kit sells for about 15 bucks. There is one holiday retailers can get excited about, Halloween. That's because experts predict sales will be up this year. Maybe because everyone needs a little bit of an escape from all this economic turmoil. Because many retailers will have less inventory in stock, popular items could sell out. So if you see something you really want, you might not want to wait till if it to see if it goes on sale. And Harry, case in point, we were going to buy you your own Bakugan set. Yes. But by the time we went back to the store, all Already gone. sold out. How all about gone. that? Now, if you really, really want to save money over this next, you know, two months or so, what's the best, best plan? Well, we've got two more online tips for you. One thing is go to major retailers to their websites mm -hmm. and sign up for their e-newsletter because you'll get an email maybe every week or every couple weeks with mm -hmm. their best deals. The other thing is go to google.com and if you find a product mm -hmm. you like, you can type, type in buy and then the product name and it'll list all the prices and where else you can find it. So you might find a better deal. There you go. Very nice. Michelle Gillen, thank Thank you very much.